back. Yeah. <coughs> and well, we're still slightly exhausted, but we'll get over that as we're about to enter a. Well, we're going back to a frozen tundra hell. If I can actually, you know, get in the friggin' hole. Ow. Get in the hole. Ah, ah, there we go. Beautiful. So, yep. We have a bunch of elevators at this end of Shozo Ruins for some reason, but hey, they're useful. Yep. So, next up, Town of the World East. Let us go there now. I don't want to have to deal with any more Shozo ghosts, but I know we're going to have to when we do clean up. Yep. Ah. Well, don't worry. Hopefully, it'll be a lot more it's bearable. Gonna, at least it'll get easier. Yeah, it'll get a lot Once, easier. By then, we'll have the item we need to deal with them more easily. Yeah. All right, we should be good. Hopefully, I picked the right way. I'm pretty sure I did. Yep. Assuming that we needed the ice beam in order to get in here. Yeah. I'd say you're right. Ooh, the charge beam. It's a wide effect of ice. Yep, we went the right way. It's guaranteed to uh, pretty much freeze everything. Yeah. We're going the right way, and there's a power if we go for this way we can't miss. It's pretty much just taking this route at all, which you can pretty much only do from this end. We'll get you this power up, so. so. Yeah, you want to take this route at least once. Because of the free missile expansion, just sitting in the venom weeds waiting for you to pick it up. Take me now. Ow, venom! Oh god! Ow, 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 pain, 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 pain! Jesus. Oh yeah! And you get this room. Oh man. I thought they were friggin'. Flying air pirates freaking partying. Oh, it might be the other end of the room. So, yeah, you can freeze enemies and blast with a missile to freaking end them. It's pretty freaking sweet. Very nice. So, yeah, that's one good effect of the ice beam. Freezing an enemy dead in its tracks can either get you separation or make it very easy for you to kill them. Just make sure you hit. Let's oh, go. yeah, there's a power up here that lot of... We'll have to get that later. For now, we have to go that way. Forward from what you're looking at. So we have to go to the door to your right. This way, right? Yep. Oh, yeah, there are air pirates partying. <laughs> I always forget about that. They're just hanging out. Oh, no, we can't ruin our good time. What an asshole. Fine, bitch, we'll leave. God damn it. We'll go play poker somewhere else. Hi, boys. God damn it! <laughs> yeah, those ones don't fight back, by the way. Which you only encounter in this room once. They just fly away. They're like their party's like, okay, fuck this party killing bitch. We're out. Ooh, what's this? Blue goo. Same container found on the space pirate research frigate. Hmm, material CPM. These are highly toxic. Maybe that phase on that's mentioned. So that's what they're using their experiments, huh? Well, things got a little more interesting. Yep. All right. Now we have to go back to Magmor Cavern so we can go back to Pendrona Drifts. <laughs> Backtracking the game. Yep. Well, we got all the items we wanted to the original Backtrack Adventure, so... Once you back to Pendrona Drifts, we'll actually be getting somewhere useful. But we're about to be getting one of the most useful power-ups for, um, traveling purposes. I'm trying to remember what it is. I think it's You'll probably, probably be able to figure out once we start going through Fedrona Drifts again. Oh! That one, right? You probably know it then. Alright. I think I remember. Yeah. It's a pretty important one. Yeah. And we need to get to the last major area, so. so Alright, so let's make our way back to Magmore Caverns. Yes. I will try and give this ice beam a little bit of love despite. It won't be useful when we get back to the Drawn Drift, but in Magmore Caverns, this thing's pretty useful. Yeah. So, and we'll get some love in, in Magmore yeah. Caverns. Especially right? if we're fighting the frickin' Magmores. It freezes them up so easily, so. Yeah. Just use the elements to your advantage. That's the first time you actually get to do that once you get the ice beam. Throw the Magmore Caverns is much easier. Get out of the way! 
Yep, we got to keep going up. Oh! You might just need to be a little higher. Yeah, get on the next wet level up and then try to do that if you can. Then again, at this point, <laughs> fuck it. Just a little too high. Get out of the way! I say that even though I'm just gonna straight up kill you. Get out of the way! You're in the way of me killing everybody. Including you! Ow! So, who's ready to die next? Would it be all of you? Eeny, meeny, miny, everyone. Eeny, meeny, miny, no. Catch the tiger by the toe. Have him go mad and kill all the foes. What? Eeny, <laughs> meeny, miny, everybody. You're all everybody. dead. You're all dead. <laughs> Killing everybody with a freaking tiger. Jeez. That's really specific! It sounds like something Coco would do. <laughs> oh god. Oh, she seems too innocent then again. She's kind of a bitch. She probably would try to do that. Yeah. How's Crash survived all the years? How's he survived all those years with her and that fucking tiger? Yeah, he finds a white. Good on him, I guess. Who knows? Well, he survives a lot of weird shit. Yeah. Freaky character. I think we want to go left now. Because we want to go back to exactly where we were after we beat up uh, Thardis, whatever his name is. Take the spider ball track, because otherwise you're going to just burn alive. It makes it look like there's supposed to be something extra back there, but there's not. There you go. It's fireball shortcut. No need to go all the way to the end when you know where you are. As long as you're gonna land on something. Excuse me. Oh! Excuse me. There we go. Oh, man. If only the ice actually stopped them from freaking committing slow. Funny. But nope. Not them, jerks. Okay. Ah, the fire's going through you. I love the way the ice spreads when it gets shot, especially with a charge shot. Now to quickly make our way over. Should we just tank it through the lava again? We don't have to. True. Oh God, well, then again. I do like to bathe in liquid hot magma. It soothes the skin. Or else it gets the hose again. Is this the right way? Yep. Unusual gravity patterns analyzed. That should give you an idea of what we're going for. Yep. So we have to go back here. All the way to the gravity chamber. Gravity pulses. So yeah. A big emphasis on gravity. We'll be doing something we'll be dealing with something about gravity. Just. I was gonna test it out in a magmore until I realized I stabbed the magmore. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> so I'm like, wait, there's supposed to be a magmore here, but then I realized I stabbed him. Yeah. We stabbed him still act like he's gone. Well, we'll be able to do it someday. The toads can't be killed by the way. Yeah. They can only be clipped over. Oh god damn it! I just know they hate four balls. I hate four balls. I don't know why. Is that like flavor or something like that? I, I don't know. I just know. No. I just know I've done it and they've immediately flipped over and Samus would like kind of like choppily move back to the platform. I was like, what? Looks so weird. It's like the weirdest fucking shit ever. Hi. Oh, you bitch. Oh, God, burning. Well, we have a save station while the time we get to the end of this, so it's not a big deal. I want to go all the way back to those stairs. Oh, yeah, by the way, if you read the scan for the uh, Flying Pirates, you would see that uh, apparently the Ice Beam is their weakness, because it freezes their thrusters. Yeah. 
Yeah, that's why particularly for them it's good. Don't use the wave buster on them. These guys, the ice beam makes it so much easier. Yep. Just use that. Otherwise, you'll regret it. You'll waste so much energy. And ammo, apparently, never mind. Oh god, okay. Apparently you can go under that. Neat. That was weird. Now that's more normal. There is one more door here, but it's not advised. I don't think we can go through there anyway. You mean that one, right? Yeah. I think it, I think you have blocked off by a giant thing of debris, which we can't get rid of. Because we, it's made out of a certain thing called the Daisy and all. It's not that or moldy, something like that. I believe it's Daisy. Maybe. <laughs> the well, fact of the matter is, um, we can't. Do it. Let's go save. Or. Nah, there should be a save there station. There should be a save station. Quick on, here. so. They have, they have a couple save stations in this area. Well, we're, we're not going to be fighting Thoris. No, Thoris, thank God. Yeah. We're now about to enter the, my least favorite segments of the game. Starting with this one. Not my least favorite, but it's up there. So turn around. First things first. Uh... The weird thing is, you only need the ice beam to get through this one door. The rest of it's wave beam doors. I don't know why. Oh, an energy tank. I see it. Oh, why'd you try to shoot me? I don't know. <laughs> oh, it's, I wish we could get that. But no, it was ice. We need to blast a peak. God damn it. You mean an explosion won't do it? Come on, that's like compact heat. Freaking coming out of everywhere. We need pure heat. God right. damn it. All right, fine. Uh, now. It's my tank and I want it now. I want it now, god damn it. All right. Well, welcome to this annoying area with a lot of vertical ascents and bull crap. Yep. The music's pretty rad. Yeah. But travel through this area is a bunch of bull crap. Hopefully do things the way we want to. We'll only have to come back to this area one more time for power-up cleanup. You basically just want to go all the way down towards the bottom. Not at the very bottom, but towards the bottom. You don't want to go through that door because that leads back to the uh, pirate, the space pirate lab. Okay. Pretty much right where the thermal visor was acquired. So yeah, definitely go, go through that. Let's keep going down a bit more. You just don't want to go into the water. You can get out if you do get in there, but you don't want to go in there. Okay, I see the door. That's the one you want to go through. I'll try to guide you through this, because this place is like a maze. I hate this place. Yeah. I hate it, too. And we're going to come across a pretty annoying enemy soon, too. One that you'll start seeing a bit more of. Not an awful lot of, though. Just a little bit. Not these guys, right? No, ice beetles are fucking peasants. They're peasant compared to you. Use the ice beam on them! <laughs> it won't affect them as much. It still damages them, but it doesn't like heal doesn't them or anything. Them. Them. No. It might be strong enough to actually kill them, but, well... They're nice creatures. Don't give them what they love. That's, that goes against video game logic. All kinds of logic in general, actually. Cool. One bit of energy. Ow! I don't know if you're gonna want the ice beam for this, but well, this is gonna suck. Might as well. Metroid Hatcher! This asshole! Or Metroid Hunter, my bad. Hunters. The Hunter Metroid. Fuck this asshole. Yep, they shoot freaking that at you. It's bullshit. So first there should be. There's the lactites you can knock down. I don't think that's one of them. Actually, it might be. But you basically want to knock down stalactites for now. So? Maybe you can reach them. Just watch out for that manta ray in the air. Yeah, that one might be a little hard. Hit the one that you can turn to the right first. Oh, that might give you a better angle. You can use a lock on, because it'll give you an easier shot. Thanks, 
Gotta get it right in the center, Ken. Right around the seam. Unfortunately, I don't think super missiles work. Yeah, the stalactites are annoying too. There's a bunch of ice down here, so we can't get that. We actually yeah. can't get that for a while. I wish we could. So we gotta shoot down the stalactites so we can get up to areas. That's pretty much all we gotta do. Sparrow's gonna be able to hit the seam somehow, or wherever the core is. Should be able to be. There should be two you can knock down to get up to new ledges. First things first. You can't go back up where you came from, though, thankfully. I hope so, otherwise. You just. If you can shoot the missile. The, the missile shoot the missile in the hole if you can. It has to be a missile, though, I'm pretty sure. Perfect shot! That'll help us get you an angle for the second one as well. Yep. And I believe there's a save room beyond that door. First. Let's knock down the light place. Oh, that's a great angle. That's a perfect angle. Ah. Apparently it was supposed to go at an angle. There we go. There is one more stalactite, but we can't get that for now. That's what, that's what the missile relates to. Over here? Go. Yep. There we go. Yes. 